on the current market scenario what's going on in the market at the moment all right let's just start with the gold so gold just look at this if we just look at over here we've been in this circle we went all the way towards 2000 we went all the way down so we have been trapped in this zone for from since 5th of june now so yeah we touched this zone 1940 came all the way back up again was a strong zone at 1965 a little bit of fake out stand all the way back down towards 40 again went back up just a little bit of consolidation went all the way up again towards 66 65 that's a psychological level all right so now again a spike again towards upside tried to break this highs failed all the way down again just look at the spikes one two three big spike fourth again if you just zoom in over here yeah so now we are heading back down again which i believe is gonna happen next week we're gonna head towards 1950 again just look at what do we have on the weekly time frame on the gold yeah so just look at this the week big big strong push to towards downside and again rejected the emas we are still down so that's what i think is going to happen again we might we might if we come back towards 1940 again and if we break 1940 just look at this if once we break this zone we are heading down towards 1900 and then so forth all right that was just a quick short update on the usd cad uh, sorry on the gold let's see what do we have on the usd cad usd cad to be honest usd cad hasn't been i would say in a trading position since two weeks now so i haven't taken a trade i took this trade over here when took some profits out this but just look at this the consolidation consolidation it's actually not giving us any volume to trade it's just trading around the emas so not rejecting towards upside oh sorry not heading to going towards upside not rejecting the ema coming towards down so it's just consolidating or consolidating around the ema so for now i think so that i'm still gonna watch usd cad let's see what do we have on the weeklies okay so just look at this a very very big strong rejection zone for weekly candles just if we start from january just look at this we had a rejection 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 again rejection 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 so it's a quite re quite strong zone for usd cad that's why the usd cad is has been struggling to gain momentum even if it's towards downside or towards upside because it's we are currently in a very strong rejection zone so let's see how which point do we head in and we'll plan our trades accordingly probably in the next coming week we'll get an updates what's gonna happen on the usd cad but for now what i think so we will head back up again towards i would say about 35 another 150 pips or so but yeah that's what i think so and we don't trade but we think we actually trade what we see in the market so let's see what the markets give us and we'll trade accordingly so yeah that was just a quick update on the usd cad and gold and i'll keep you guys updated and hopefully best of luck for the next week and we'll stay in touch cheers